Hey everyone, Christy Rice here. I wanted to come on today and talk about a little something different. Yes, I'm painting here. I'm in Zion National Park actually. And so I'm doing a little sketch of the Zion Red Rock Vista. What I really want to talk about though is creativity. It's such an overused word, one that we hear over and over again. And as anyone who enjoys painting, is curious about painting, or has been painting their whole lives, it can be kind of an obscure thing to capture in your life, this creativity. And I think the biggest thing I get asked all the time, how do you stay creative? How do you stay inspired? And it's difficult. As an artist, everyone thinks you always have ideas, you always have motivation to paint and create, but it's not the case. I wanted to, so I wanted to speak a little bit about that today. I think the biggest thing that we can do to stay creative is to just push, push ourselves. The biggest hurdle to inspiration and creativity is just doing and overcoming that draw in us to be fearful of what we might create, be fearful of the end result, be fearful of placing a brush stroke that we don't like, we have to get over that. And one of the biggest ways that I am able to get over that is, is by getting out in the world a little bit. Um, whether you get out in the world and, and travel thousands of miles somewhere, or you just walk out your front door and take a walk. And I know it sounds trite and simple, but for me, it has been so true. I wanna read a little something from Edward Abbey um, kind of a controversial guy, but I love his writing. And these are from Desert Solitaire. Wilderness, the word itself, is music. Another one I adore. A man could be a lover and defender of the wilderness without ever in his lifetime leaving the boundaries of asphalt, power lines, and right-angled surfaces. We need wilderness, whether or not we ever set foot in it. We need a refuge, even though we never need to set foot in it. We need the possibility of escape as surely as we need hope. We need the possibility of escape as surely as we need hope. That one line gets to the heart of creativity and the search for it. You need to get out in the world. You need to know that you can walk out your front door, breathe in the fresh air and feel renewed. Again, it sounds so simple, but sometimes the simplest things are the hardest to accomplish. Thanks so much for listening to my creative rambles today, and I hope my simple words and simple thoughts have in some way inspired you. All I can say is keep pushing, paint when you don't feel like it, draw when you don't feel like it, just keep pushing. Thanks guys, until next time, happy painting.